ISTQB Foundation Level Question 58. Which of the following could be a reason for a failure? 1. Documentation fault. 2. Software fault. 3. Design fault. 4. Environment fault. Answers. A. 2 is a valid reason. B. 2, 3 and 4 are valid reasons. C. 1, 2 and 3 are valid reasons. D. All of above. Take a moment to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to don't miss new ISTQB questions and answers that will help you guaranteed and chancing your skills. Join us on this learning journey. You can click on pass to choose your own answer before you see the correct answer on the screen. Correct answer is D, all of above, according to ISTQB syllabus. Let's look at all the statements from 1 to 4. Statement 1 is valid. If the documentation such as user manuals or technical specifications contains errors or is unclear, users or developers might misinterpret the information, leading to a fail in understanding how to use or implement the software correctly. Statement 2 is valid. This statement refers to defects or bugs in the software code. These faults can cause the software to behave unexpectedly, crash, or produce incorrect results, leading to errors in the system's functionality. Statement 3 is valid. Flaws in the system's design, such as incorrect algorithms or data structures, can lead to failures. A design fault might cause the system to be unable to handle specific scenarios or inputs properly, resulting in failures during execution. Statement 4 is valid. Issues related to the environmental where the software runs, including hardware configuration, network settings, or dependencies on other software components, can lead to failures. Changes in the environment may cause the software to behave differently than expected, resulting in failures. In summary, each of these faults can contribute to the failure of a software system, making the potential reasons that need to be investigated and addressed during the debugging and troubleshooting process. All of the above leads us to the correct answer D. Explanation Firstly, Let's look at the definition of failure in the ISTQB glossary. Failure is an event in which a component or system does not perform a required function within specified limits. Secondly, let's look at the section 1.2.3 Errors, Defects, Failures and Root Causes in the ISTQB syllabus, where we can see that 1. Defects can be found in documentation. Statement 1. 2. Defects in artifacts produced early in the CDLC. Statement 2 and 3. 3. Some defects will always result in a failure if executed. Statement 2 and 3. 4. 
failures can also be caused by environmental conditions. Statement 4. And finally, defects, faults, bugs, which in turn may result in failures. All of the above leads us to the correct answer D. I do think that you are incredibly talented person and it will be ridiculously easy for you to answer such kinds of questions if you figure out these all the ISTQB questions on my video channel and then passing the certified tester foundation level exam will not be a dream but a reality. Never give up.